Hello guys, and welcome back to my channel. I have the synth guide finally ready for you guys. Before I get into it, I want to ask you guys, what do you think of an encounters tournament hosted by me? I think it'd be for fun, mostly, but um, I, would, I would want the winner to get a shout out on one of my videos. Comment down below to let me know what you think of it, and join my Discord for more updates on the tournament or any other events that are happening. Also, make sure to sub and like the video if you haven't already. I want to get the 500 subscribers so I can unlock the community tab for the channel. It'll allow me to communicate better with you guys and hopefully do cool things for you guys. Anyways, let's get right into the synth guide. Starting with synth's basic attack. She swings forward using her gauntlets. Each hit does 20 damage, does 50 knockback, gives 25 ult charge, and costs 20 energy per swing. Each time she punches, she dashes forward a little bit. This is the move you'll be using the edge guard because of the amount of knockback it does. For Synth special, she charges up a lasso and throws it out. If it hits an enemy, they get pulled in. It does 5 damage, gives 25 pull charge, and it costs 30 energy per cast. The farther you are from them, the harder you will pull them. You can spam this move at close range to get your ultimate extremely fast. When using your special, make sure you dash to the side when you, whenever you use it. This will increase the range of it and make it easier for you to hit. Just like Gunswell, you don't need to hit the tip of this move. You can hit any part of it to pull them in. You can also use this move to pull enemies that are above you like this. For Synth's unique, she slows everyone that's near her in this dome shape. Each cast will cost you 40 energy. The slow lasts for exactly one second, and while they're slowed, it pauses their stamina regen. Her unique can only be casted while she's on the ground. Try to use this move when they're near the edge. You can slow them, reposition yourself, and then knock them back. You can also mix it up by slowing them, and then trying to pull them down. You don't even necessarily have to pull them downwards like that, but you can just go behind them and pull them back. Synth's ultimate. She slams the ground, dealing 20 damage and a ton of knockback to anyone hit by it. When you use your ult, the closer you, you are to your enemy when you hit them, the higher up they will go. However, hitting your ultimate at the edge will send them flying out away from you. You always want to try hitting your ultimate at the very edge of it. With all that being said, let's move on to your pros and cons. Starting with Synth's pros. Her knockback is insane. The amount of knockback her basic attack does in ultimate is really good. This also indirectly makes her really good at edge guarding. Synth has a lot of control over how the battle goes. She can quite literally pull her opponent to wherever she wants them to be just as long as she can hit her lasso. She can always put her enemies in the unfavorable positions using her lasso. Synth's skill ceiling is also extremely high. There's so much to learn about this character. If you're looking for a character to main that will grow with your skill, I'd highly recommend Synth. For Synth's con, she's extremely hard to play. If it's your first time playing her, you'll most likely get destroyed and it might not be fun. But I promise you, as you put more time into this character, you'll start to really enjoy her. Synth has to be grounded to use her ultimate and her E. This really limits her positioning. Your basic attack and your lasso can be used to combo your enemy if you use them together. You can knock them away a bunch and then pull them right back in for round two. Synth can constantly pull her enemies into positions that aren't great for them by using her lasso. The farther away they are when they're hit by her lasso, the harder they'll be pulled. You can use your lasso while you're under your enemy to pull them into the void. This is extremely hard but very rewarding. You can even kill them and when they haven't even taken any damage yet. Synth's unique pauses stamina once the enemy is affected by it. Lastly, you can use your unique to help you edge guard. This only applies if they're within range with it. Remember that the range is like a dome around Synth, so you can hit people above you. And yeah, that's it for the Synth Guide. Thank you guys for watching. I also want to give thanks to my Discord and the Encounter Discord for helping me with Synth tips and test things out and whatnot. So yeah, thank you guys so much, and yeah, thank you. And try to show you guys what I'm talking about. I'll play one match of Synth. Okay. We're going to get up against Ryan. This is a really interesting matchup. Ryan does really good in close range, but so does Synth. Although, I don't know, it's like a really balanced matchup. So, I think it honestly comes down to how I play it. I'll see if I can try to get some early damage without getting too close to him, because he's going to start M1-ing.
that missed. I'm actually not sure how to really interact with him. He's staying back in like... Oh. Maybe I can do some sort of like that. Edge guard? I guess what you need to boss stamina. Push him back. Yeah. I think my unique kills him there. Or maybe not. He was in the air for quite a while, so. I'm not sure what this guy's doing. I bully him a bit more. Not too much because I don't want him to get his ult. I flop my ult. <laughs> I don't, this guy's movements are so weird. I'm trying to use a combination of my special and basic attack to punch him without actually getting too close. I'm actually gonna cancel that. Okay, never mind. I was gonna cancel my um, special so I can use my E, but he, he dies. I wanna see if I can snipe him from off the map. Oh, wait, not this. That's so hard to do. I want to do it though. Assuming I don't kill myself trying to do it. <laughs> One more time. Alright. No more. Oh no, I'm, I'm ulted. Goodbye. He's gonna ult me? Maybe he's like 90. Literally 10 away from ult. Just literally, yeah, I'm ulted. Goodbye. There it is. I am so mad. I am so mad. I'm actually tilted. I am so tilted. It's not even funny. No, get, get down here. That didn't hit. When will the scammery end? That was so close. Alright, I'm gonna go back to my original strategy. I'm gonna try to pull him. Slap. Pull. Slap. <laughs> I can kinda- I can keep doing this to avoid taking too much damage. I'm gonna unique him the second he gets near me. All stamina, and he's just- he's just gone. Oh, I got him. <laughs> and that's GG. <laughs> so that's what I mean by 7th special being really good. Like, you literally kill someone at zero like damage. It's actually insane.